Hello, this is Matthew Burke with Betwixt Games, and I'm going to be running a um, series of very short tutorials on very beginner basic Unity gotchas and problems that you might encounter um, when you're just starting out with Unity in Maya. And hopefully, if you're getting into it, then these will be really helpful. So the first topic we're going to cover today is normals, and if you take a look at this object I've imported, you can see right off the bat that it's got some serious issues. Um, we can see straight through it. Uh, it looks terrible. And the first time you get something like this, you might be wondering what's going on. You go back into Maya and you're like, well, it looks fine. I don't know what the problem is. Well, most of the time that's a normal issue. And by default, um, Maya and Maya LT, which I'm using right now, do not display normal issues because Maya is powerful enough to render normal render uh, faces on both sides. And what a normal is is a um, line that shoots out of the middle of every single face on an object and tells the camera what is that essentially is that face facing in or facing out? Is it pointing towards the camera or away from the camera? And in Unity, if it's pointing away from the camera, it won't render. So there's a couple ways to see if your normals are all messed up. So the most obvious way is if you go to lighting, two-sided lighting or um, double-sided lighting, sometimes they change the names up, uh, is usually clicked by default. If you turn that off, it will only render on one side. So now you see all of these black faces. That means that those normals are facing the other direction. If I go into the object, you can see that the majority are facing out, but we do have some that are facing in. Now, there are a couple other ways, and I would recommend using both. Um, if you go to display, polygons, and you have your object selected, and you do face normals, you can actually see the normals themselves and what direction they're painting, if it's a little pointing. If it's a little dot like this, it means that they're pointing away from the camera or in. And if they're out like that, you know that they're good. And the majority of the time, you want your normals facing out. But let's say you're making an interior environment, let's say a room, you want those normals facing in. Now, they're very easy to fix, but a lot of people don't check, uh, especially when you're starting out and you don't realize, and you're going to get into Unity, and you might not even notice there's a hole. And the problem is, is you might think you could just cover it, but it... um. It can show through a lot, um, and it's really not that hard to fix. You just kind of want to select all the faces. All you have to do is go spacebar, normals, reverse, and uh, looks like I missed one here. Select it, reverse, then just do a quick check. Make sure all those green lines are good. Make sure there's no black spots. If you go into the object, everything should be black. That's all looking pretty good. See, very quick to fix. Um, obviously, the more complex, dense the meshes, the more normals you have to deal with. Um, so you might want to check as you're going on. And honestly, I, there's a lot of tools and um, tricks in Maya that can lead to this type of thing. Um, so it's better just to keep checking. Um, just stay up with it. So once you've done this, uh, if we go back into Unity and take our new object, place it right here, you can see that those problems um, are not there anymore. The one thing that I should note is, even if it's a tiny hole, if the camera can see just a little bit of it, it will shoot through the entire object because the, the faces on the other side, those normals are pointing away from the camera, so it's try it can't render the other side of that face. And that can throw a lot of people up, so it's best just to really make sure you know what the purpose of the object is in the scene and where the normals are facing. And use two-sided lighting, one-sided lighting, and display face normals to make sure that you are 100% um, doing what you're supposed to be doing with that object. Super quick to fix, but it can trip a lot of people up, and um, I see this kind of thing all the time when people give me objects. And it's al almost always a normal problem. So thank you. Again, this is Matthew Burke, and I'll be running this series. Um, if you have any questions on normals or suggestions for these uh, videos, if you're just starting out, 
Um, please leave a comment. I'll try to respond as soon as possible. And uh, thank you for watching.